Welcome back to Poor Boy. And today it's windy. We got a headwind coming in out here trying to test some uh, discs. But today we got a Innova Pro Gorgon. Uh, it's coming in 173 grams. Uh, B10, glide of six, turn of negative two, and a fade of one. So it is an uh, understable distance driver. Now we got the wind blowing. <laughs> first time throwing this, first honest review of it. You know, will it be good, will it be bad? Who knows, but we're going to throw the heck out of it anyways. Just for y'all, you can see it's blowing straight at us from where we're throwing. So we're going to try to, we're going to, try to get it up there and see what we can do. Yeah, I said a little too high. All right. So the Gorgon basically just anhyzered out and a uh, headwind, which I figured it would. We got kind of a tailwind now, so the understability should be better now. So uh, we'll throw a little bit uphill and see how good it does here. Oh yeah, that's much better. All right. So the Gorgon's actually it loves a tailwind, which most understable discs do. We're gonna put a little bit of power on it and get it down here and see what we can do. Oh, it is. All right, so we're out here another day. We was hoping that the wind would have died down, but alas, the wind just every time I get out here, try to throw disc, it's got to be windy. But we're going to throw the Gorgon and see if we can get it close to the basket. All right, so let's talk about the Gorgon from Minipa. This is in their new Pro Plastic. Really love this plastic. Um, it's really good out here. It, it hates the wind. I will, you know, for it being an understable driver, it does hate the wind. But loves the tailwind. This would be great in the tailwind. Get you some good distance on it. I love that it's got this thick rim and it's deep. So I feel like I can get some really good power on it. I ain't worried about, you know, losing it or letting it go early. Uh, it's a really great disc. It's probably going to make it in the bag uh, until something could uh, knock it out. Because this is the exact same flight path as the Sapphire from uh, Latitude 64, I'm pretty sure. I think it's theirs, or it might be West Side. I can't remember which one, but it's it's... Exact same as sapphire, but I like this one over the sapphire. 173 grams. It's in that really good sweet spot for a distance driver. It's a really great 10 speed with a lot of glide, so this will be able to get some distance for me. Uh, we're going to try to put some more distance on it. Come the more I throw and everything else, maybe we can get it up to about 350, 400 feet by next year with a disc like this. But hey, I hope you liked the video, and as always, this is Poor Boy reminding you to play the sport and grow the sport that is disc golf. Thanks for watching.